Okay, this is just a short video to show you how to map your tablet to a network drive on your computer, be it a laptop or desktop. Here we go. So you press start, you press computer, uh, you'll see your C drive, D drive there. You can refresh button, nothing else will come up. You've got your DVD rewrite, your E drive, that's it. But what you need to do at the top there, you need to press map network drive there's all your drives there just keep it on Z or Z as the Americans say right then press folder and you want to be backward slash try again backward slash and this is a playbook that's what I've named it, so you put that in. And underscore button, but it's that one you need, which I think could be called middle score. I'm not so sure. Um, and then next, what you need is either your IP address for your router, and I'll show you how to get that so that you my tablet is hooked up to my TV so there's two ways to do it and I'll show you both ways so where that cog is top right press that go to your Wi-Fi and da -da -da, let's have a look Wi-Fi yeah press the question mark at the bottom then I think, yeah, you want Wi-Fi information and, no you don't, you want internet connection. The top there is your IP address. In this case, 192.168.164. Now, I could put that in. And I suppose if it's, um, if you've got Apple or any of those, that's what you, you're going to need, I would have thought. But in this case, I'm going to come right out of that, press the cog again. The top one, left-hand side, it says about, press that and press the drop down menu and in this case you want hardware now at the top there it's giving you a pin number each blackberry tablet has their own unique pin number and all you need is the last four either letters or numbers in this case 2c7f if you can see that sorry about the shaky video work so you want that b2 let's get that right b2 to, no, sorry, I just want 2C7F. So that's all we'll put in there. 2C7F. That's the last four. And one backward slash and press media. M E D I A. Okay, and that should be it. So what you need to do then is press finish. And there it is. So you need to put a username in. So in this case again, it's playbook. And I'm gonna put my password in if I remember it. Uh put my caps lock on there. And that's it, hopefully. So press OK. Login unsuccessful. So I've obviously got that wrong. I'll give it another go. This is the password that I've put on my playbook. Haha. <laughs> no, it's that that I've got wrong the top, I've just noticed. Try that. Hopefully that's it. And that's done it. And so what's happened now, that's, you can see all, all these files, folders, whatever, that's what's on my tablet. So then, I mean, you can either look at them, you can drag and drop 
and it's so much easier, much quicker. That's just my battery noise, low battery noise going off. So these are all pictures that are actually on my playbook, but not on my tablet at the minute. And so you could just download them straight away. And that's it, easy as that. And there it is. He's mapped it. Thank you.